you're going to probably have a lot of protection in there. So what we're doing with our five man right now is he's not only screaming in the order, but which is the obvious part of the play, and spreading the ball. But we're going to give him a run through the rim to post without three guys in there. Okay? So here's what we've got. Any time the defender on the ball goes under the screen, as he comes under the ball, keep coming, keep coming, get to the spot. You automatically turn and get over the defender and re screen. You, you go over under the next line. But you want to work on this cat and mouse game up right here with your guard and your screen. You got to practice this. Get some tape of some of those European teams from the World Championships, and you'll see these guys come the off, bounce, rip, re screen, maybe the guy, oh, come on, come on, break. You got to do the right. Maybe as he comes back and re screens, Ray Chief, crossover, attack, here, help, slide, kick. Alright, you want to you play the cat and mouse game up here. Don't run, pick, and roll. You know, that, uh, one of the things I learned about jump shot plays from Jeff and Dunny was if your jump shooter only has one route to the ball, you come easy to guard. Same thing up here. Give these guys some freedom to play cat and mouse. Rescreening is critical. And we make it automatic if it goes under. Okay? So here's what we've got. Keep that step off. Remember, this came out of that Brazil play. You're gonna, you're gonna slide, you're all the way down, you're all the way down, okay? As our point guard comes off, let's say he comes off the first side, his job is to get into the lane, get as deep as he can, scream, run to the rim, and, and duck in, post up, okay? As he comes off, our three man circles behind. Now look at the spacing we have. Okay, I want, I want you to watch this. You want to do that again. Guard, guard, guard this guy. Yep. Guard that guy in the corner. Alright. So now you're watching this guy. Come on. You roll hard. Freeze. Okay. These guys have got to get in here and zone up and try to tag this guy if they can. Okay. We have a. Uh, come on out. You'll come out, yeah. Let's say you're going to our three man, okay? Our point guard comes off. You stand in as you saw the ball get into the lane. They throw it back. Now, we, look where we can go with this. Point guard to the rim. Point guard to the roller. Point guard to the kick out of the corner. Point guard to the opposite. This guy sucks in, as you will. And if we get this guy sucked in, point guard throws it here. Now, this is the beauty of the offense. I'll show you what Noble does in a second. When we throw it, we can't get it into the paint off the drive and pitch. Wherever we throw it now on the perimeter, we're creating a closeout situation. So now, we might not necessarily want him shooting his jump shot, okay? And, but what we do have is probably a guy flying at him as she passes. Okay, now you drive it. Okay, now, big guy, your job anytime the ball comes at you, go opposite of the ball to create a driving lane. Okay, so now you're driving it. Maybe if you kick it back here, circle through, you drive it in the middle. Okay, and we play. 